Well, friend, we have some celebrating to do. We just passed 1,000 subscribers on this Thunkable X Tutorials YouTube channel, and I am so excited. And I think this calls for getting rid of all of this and having a little bit of a fireside chat about the future of everything. So let me, uh, Alrighty, can you see me all right? I think it looks it looks all good. This is my spare bedroom coming from you live. Uh, yeah, so friend, awesome. I am uh, super, super stoked at being a, a YouTube creator. I don't, can I, can, am I allowed to say that? It's, I don't know, it's it's a different journey. I definitely respect, you know, everyone else who has made it to a thousand subscribers and, and even more. Uh, you know, I started this journey about six months ago with the goal of getting to a thousand su subscribers by the end of the year. And here we are about halfway through and we have, uh, we have made that happen. And that really tells me at least one thing and it's the fact that I, I guess I'm on, on a good journey and that the Thunkable platform is growing and, and you are interested in, in learning more about, about Thunkable and, and I, I'm so, so <laughs> excited for that. And today there's not really gonna be a tutorial. Um, I, I really just wanted to take a break this week and kind of just get a chance to, to chat with you. I hope that is okay. And today I really want to announce something that uh, I'm really excited about that I've been working on. But before we get to that, you know, I really don't get a chance to kind of talk to you and uh, tell you <laughs> anything about myself. And I, I wanna get to know you and I want you to get to know me. It's just kind of the the part of, of having a relationship and having a community. So um, yeah, my name is, is Darren and I really love creating. Um, I see that in my life for a long time, all the way back to like the beginning of grade school and going into junior high, um, just getting to, to learning how to play music. Music was kind of my first passion. I remember seeing my my cousin on stage playing drums at church and I was just like, man, I want to be a drummer. And so from there, it just kind of was this continuous cycle of me wanting to learn how to do something and then just figuring out how, how to do that thing. So whether it was learning how to play drums or learning how to play the keyboard or learning how to play the guitar or eventually my mind kind of drifted off into coding so then it was you know learning how to make a web page learning how to make a dynamic web page learning um, how to to make different things and then one day one day i came across this this app builder called Thunkable and it was really just kind of an interesting thing. I volunteered for something through my work doing a STEM camp and they were making apps through this tool called Thunkable and my mind was just blown that you were able to make an app without having to learn how to you know set up a system to work on in Swift or work in Android Studio and you're just able to do it all from your web browser and uh, it was amazing. And so from there, I was like, man, this this is the future. <laughs> I believe in it. I wanna be a part of this. And so from there, I was like, man, I gotta start making some tutorials for this. And thus, that is how Darren came to Thunkable. And here we are now, looking ahead, looking towards the future. Yeah, about the future. Two things. So uh, first, I have something to ask of you. And then second is the kind of thing I'm excited about. So the first thing is, you know, we're halfway through this year. We're at a thousand subscribers. So I thought it would be a really good time just to kind of get your feedback on how I am serving you and what kind of tutorials you would like to see in the coming days. Because, you know, I have an idea of things I'd like to teach and things that I think are cool, but I would really just love to hear from you, hear what you would like to learn about, hear how, just kind of like the structure of tutorials I should be doing. And uh, yeah, so what I've done is I've created a Google survey. Uh, it's, I think it's four multiple choice questions and then maybe one free text. Should take you about two minutes. Um, that link is in the description. And yeah, I just kind of want to get 
some feedback from the audience, get the feedback from you on how I should do my tutorials going forward. So go fill out that survey that's going to help a lot for the future. And then the second thing is, I'll just come out and say it, uh, I now have a website. Some of you might have checked out amblemind.com as that is what my email is. And you might've seen that in some of my, my videos. Amblemind is supposed to be like, or it is kind of my creative brand. So that's like specific just to all the things I'm working on. Uh, I wanna kind of throw under, under that website. But I wanted a website specific to kind of coding and specific to Thunkable X tutorials. So the website is called xtutorials.io. And I'm calling it X Tutorials because the channel is Thunkable X Tutorials, but I don't want to restrict what I teach you to just Thunkable. Uh, I have not, I mean, I have a feeling some of you are interested in, in doing more with apps and maybe you're interested in, in going to college or even getting a job someday doing maybe like some web development. Um, so maybe someday I'll get into doing some tutorials for that. And all of that can be housed under xtutorials.io. Now I love the name xtutorials because if you do any kind of coding or if you're familiar with, with math, x is just kind of the gener generic variable name. So whenever you create a variable, you you know you call it x. You can think about for loops. If you know anything about those in coding, you always say, you know, in classic Java, you know, X is equal to zero, so on, so on, so forth. It's always X, we always fall back to X. So um, X tutorials, meaning uh, we can do any kind of like, we can throw in any kind of uh, tutorial before that. So you can think about Funkable tutorials or web development tutorials or uh, bootstrap tutorials, you know? So I kind of like that name and then .io because IO has become just kind of like the cool technology startup kind of extension. So that's why we've gone with xtutorials.io. So uh, I'm officially announcing that today. The website does not have a lot on it yet. And so in the coming months, I'll be rolling out some new things. And next week, actually, I'll be rolling out something that I'm really excited to share with you that is kind of a part of part of my website. So I'll leave you with that little teaser and you'll just have to come back next week to check out that video and yeah. So really this video is just really one big thank you to you. I probably would have given up a few months ago if it wasn't for you. If nobody was, would have subscribed and said that they wanted to hear me talk or give tutorials, I would have given up a long time ago. So friend, uh, I really just want to thank you for uh, subscribing. Thank you for supporting me in this endeavor. And uh, again, I want to remind you about that link to kind of let me know about what you want to see in the future, because as much as I've been talking about me in this video, really what I want to do is empower you and equip you in your coding journey. So thanks again. Happy 1000 and happy coding.